guys and welcome back to another DIY party prep with me. This party prep is for my oldest who always seems to keep me on my toes for his parties. All I know is that we see Elemental one week and the very next week he changed his party thing. I don't blame him, it was such a good movie and if you have little ones and you haven't checked it out, you definitely should. to have a couple pictures printed off along with a welcome sign I made on Canva. What I love about Canva is um, it's free to make a lot of these things and all you really need is a printer, no Cricut required. So for his welcome sign, I just designed it on Canva. Um, it's an eight by 10 and I just have Walgreens printed out for me on their paper. And I think it just adds such a great touch to welcome all your guests. So right now I'm just gonna switch it out from our last party. So I purchased these gift boxes from Dollar Tree and I'm just going to take these thank you notes that I made on Canva and just glue it. It's such a simple and affordable way to thank your guests and add a little personal touch. One thing that was really important to me was to have all four elements included in this box as well. So in lieu of giving little children fire, we did glow sticks, we did water for water, we did Oreos and pretzels for earth, and for air we did bubbles that was in it, which was pretty cool. And I can't take credit for this because I seen it on TikTok first, but we also made a pinata. So depending on how many streamers you use, it'll cost around four to five dollars. I just used a box I already had, and this was my first one, so I definitely have to redeem myself because it was a little wonky, but it did the trick. The thing I did learn is to definitely do thicker strips or double the strips instead of doing it single streamers. So his actual party was at an ice cream place, which we typically like to use because they provide a lot. We kept it real simple and just did pizza. Okay, fast forward to his actual birthday where I am rushing to decorate so that he can have a birthday surprise. One thing my kids really look forward to every year is a homemade cake and I always struggle but they always like it and in the end that's all that matters. I actually requested a blueberry cake that was bouncy. <laughs> So I came up with a blueberry angel food cake. Now I've personally never made this cake before, so box cake it was. And it was right around this point that I realized that I'm probably overfilling it. But I was already in it, so I just had to see it through. I know what you're thinking. She's a little crispy, a little Cajun, but we're gonna make it work. So I just trimmed off the real crunchy parts, and it's as good as new. All kinds of crazy. give myself such a hard time when it comes to these cakes but my kids always love them and honestly that's all that matters I honestly just want them to always feel loved and special on their birthdays and as always 
everything will be listed in the description below along with my amazon storefront where you can find all of your party prep needs Come on. Come on. What? Go look at your stuff. Is it cool? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. I'm sure. That element of shirt? Yeah. How cool. Did you look at your cake? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. Who is it? Um, I did it Wade. Do it look like Wade? Did I do a good job? I think so. Yay! Get the biggest one. Careful, watch your cake. It's okay. What? Is that Marvel? Yeah, it's uh, The Eternals? Yeah. What? Show me. Emery. Wow, love it.